Hi everybody, Cushion on a clone once again with another review. Well, this time is going to be a console review and this has to be my first one that I'm doing. Sorry, I'm a little hungry right now. Um, probably wondering what's in this. It, well, it's uh, uh, chicken slices, like, you know, stuff like you get from a deli, cheese, and a tortilla. And I got another one right here. I'll probably be eating that along the way. But anyway, what? You're probably wondering what console I'm going to be reviewing. Well, I will show you. Now, if you watched my recent uh, video that I did on my Uncle Betty 32 k channel, if you have seen it, I don't think so, but um, on that channel I made a video, well, anyway, I made a video and uh, I introduced this little puppy that I got for my birthday, that was on the 8th of August. Now what is it going to, what am I, so what am I reviewing? Cut to the chase and I'll show you. The Xbox 360, but this time, but this one's the arcade edition. Now you may be think. Now uh, what am I? What do I have to say about it? Well, it's just like any other 360, but and this and that this also has to be the cheapest 360 I've ever laid eyes on. Excuse me. Okay. Now this 360. Let me see. It's uh. It's a lot different. Well, not a lot different, but I guess in a sense it is different from the the X, the regular Xbox 360 and Xbox 360 Elite. Now, the Xbox Arcade X 360 Arcade Edition is not only cheap, but it doesn't come with everything that the, a regular Xbox 360 does. And uh, thing and this hard drive that it uses only has 256 megabytes according to the box that I have which is still in my closet right now sorry I had to stop to eat the rest of my quesadilla because I didn't want to have to keep grabbing and eating and grabbing and eating it so basically that it let's recap we only have 256 megabytes with this uh, system and uh, it only comes with a standard controller which is right here on my bed. A standard wireless controller, and it comes with uh, two double A's. Comes with Duracell. You get the idea. It has two. It comes with two double A's that you put in yourself, and uh, you just put it in the back, and uh, you're ready to play. And uh, like any other Xbox 360, the controllers have the ability to turn on the console with the press of this button. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. Yeah, that's right, it's using batteries, my mistake. I'll take that out so it doesn't waste power. Okay. Now, it's pretty cool, I just, but, uh, well, yeah, you get the idea. It's just a controller. Now, what are my thoughts on this? Well, this uh, thing is well pretty much the same as any other Xbox 360. It plays like an Xbox 360, and the thing is, there's nothing arcadey about it. I think it's a kind of a misnomer to name it like Xbox 360 Arcade because there's nothing arcadey about it. There's nothing like, the, and there's like no. I mean, I think they should have put in arcade games in the game, like that are, that are there so you could play them. Like, I don't know, stuff like Street Fighter 2 or anything like that, like already on the system, because you're saying it's arcade, but there's nothing on it when you first start it. All, all you get to do when you first get this is that you just uh, create your avatar and that's it. That's all you can really do until you get, like, games and uh, the Xbox Live ability so yeah but overall it's a good system I think it's good and uh, I probably should uh, 
show this uh, in action, so I will. Just uh, hold on and I'll uh, set it up. Okay, I set it up. I'm going to test it out for you guys. Turn on the TV. Let's uh, get the mic there. It's on. And let's turn this on. Sorry, the AV jacks were fully in, so uh, let's turn it on again. There we go. Uh, I don't think you can see that. Um, probably should uh, close the blinds. But anyway, here's uh, 360, it works. Oh, shit. Now it's on. Uh, oh shit. Fuck. The battery's died. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to get rid of these two aerosols. Put in some Panasonic. That's what I'm talking about. Last two as well. Nice. So yeah, uh, if you have the battery packs, they will run out over time. So and you'll have to put in more batteries. I would just get uh, regular. I would get a rechargeable pack because uh, you don't want to have to waste your time buying more and more of these things. So yeah, basically it works fine. I mean, God, here's my little avatar of me. Say hi. I don't know if you can see that or not, but he's waving. Yeah, and you could do some fun things with them. But, uh, yeah, I mean, right now, I don't, that's basically it. It's just regular Xbox. And uh, let's uh, pop in a game for you guys. And uh, I'm going to probably pop in my first game that I have. Uh, Grand Theft Auto 4. Freaking love this game, I swear. I haven't, I have been playing this for like over three days straight since, ever since I got it on my birthday. So it's reading. So reading and it says uh, starting to play. Sorry if it seems dark, but uh, you know, it happens. Uh, you can't see that, can you? It's, it's all weird, huh? There you go. That's better. We were just seeing the player of the TV. Uh, thing I hate about this uh, version of the, the of the Xbox 360, the arcade edition, is that it comes with a hard drive that doesn't backplay Xbox, regular Xbox games. Because I have an Xbox and I have ton, like Xbox games and uh, I can't even play them on the 360 because I was planning on getting rid of that. But uh, I guess not. But uh, that's the beauty of the 360. You could just remove the, the hard drive and place it with another one. So uh, with either a 60 gig or a 120 gig, which is a lot of memory. But yeah, now it's uh, playing fine, it works, controller works, and uh, just for the sake of this video, I'll, uh, you know, I'll just fall off to my dad. Yay! I died! <laughs>